Five days sanctions against Putin and his thugs. 70 years of oppression by the Palestinians. You're happy to correctly use the most strong and robust language to describe the crimes against humanity of Vladimir Putin, but you will not use the same strength of language when it comes to describing the Isra Israel's treatment of the Palestinians when it is now being documented and detailed by two of the most uh, respected human rights organisations in the world and indeed has been alleged by dozens and dozens of non-governmental organisations uh, and to be honest anybody who looks honestly at the decades of brutal, inhumane persecution of the Palestinians, successive assaults uh, on Gaza, the annexation of their land and territory, the systematic application of apartheid rules, uh, Amnesty International are calling for Israel to be referred to the International Criminal Court for Crimes Against Humanity. Will you support it? They are calling for targeted sanctions against Israeli officials who are perpetuating the system of apartheid just exactly the same types of sanctions you've just initiated against Vladimir Putin, will you support it? Uh, and I think the answer is clearly you're not going to. And then we ask the question, why? Why? Ambassador, I, I will say frankly, I'm one of the people who thinks you should be expelled from this country and uh, I believe that uh, that's nothing to do with you personally, uh, it's to do with the policies of your state. And uh, I think uh, along with Desmond Tutu that the time for treating you as a normal state is over because you're not behaving as a normal state. If I was Jewish and had never stepped foot in Israel, I could claim citizenship there tomorrow, but six million people whose origins are in what you now call Israel who were forced out in 1947 or 48 do not have that right.